Hey there, welcome to day 333 of our Get Your Goals Annual Challenge. Sharon Hornelson here, and our topic today is step six of our goal process. This January, we spent the entire month studying goals, how to set them, how to get them, how to make sure that you can create a process and have a framework that will help you to get whatever it is that you want. By doing this, you've got to do something, right? You have to take some action and do some things. But we came up with our own seven-step process that helps us to ensure that we get what we want in each of the different areas and aspects of our life. And we have spent a month on each of the nine life framework areas. Let's see if I got that handy. No, I do not. Uh, I guess this is a one of it. Uh, physical, mental, emotional, spiritual, financial, relationships, communication, confidence, and contribution. We covered all of those. We spent an entire month on each one of those areas and aspects of our life. We went through the SOAP framework. We went through this goal process with a specific goal. And now we're going through and we're looking at, and we spent this month reviewing where we're at, checking our progress, actually doing this same process for all of our goals. Now we set a goal that we're working on and we're on step six today, which is what I call now ARS. It didn't start out as ARS, but now ARS, ARS is pretty easy to remember because it's funny and it clicks in my brain. Might not work for you if you don't like that order. You can remember them in any order you want, but it stands for resources, support, and accountability. And those are three topics that we want to look at as we are determining what it's going to take to get this goal, to get the goal that we set for ourselves. Now, I am setting up a nonprofit for the blind. Why? Well, because I'm legally blind and there's a lot of things I don't know and I want to find out. And so if I'm going to find them out and go through a process, I'm going to then share that process with other blind people for free so that they can get the resources and get the things that they need as well. So as far as accountability resources and support goes, I'm going to analyze today and think about well, what do I have for accountability? Am I accountable to myself? Do I have other people that are holding me accountable to this? Uh, so what do I have? What do I need for accountability? And what do I want? What would I like? Do I want a, an accountability partner? Do I want somebody who's going to hold my feet to the fire and make sure I do all the things that I say I'm going to do? I'm thinking yes for this one, which normally I am terrific at holding myself accountable. But I discovered that this year I let my financial goals slip and I let my, at least the one that I set for this challenge, and I let my spiritual goal slip the one I set for this challenge. So in order to bring me back home, I'm combining those with contribution area, which is to set up a nonprofit. And that will help do the financial, the spiritual, because it helps my spirit when I help other people, and my contribution goal. And that helps my contribution when I create a legacy, when I create something that's going to last beyond me and my presence here on earth. So accountability, what do I have? What do I need? What do I want? Resources. What resources do I have to make this project a reality? Remember, I've got eight different steps and eight different strategies and eight different plans for each of the subsets that come under each of those eight things that have to get done. And they became my milestones. And I selected and created a measure for each one of those uh, milestones so that I know if I'm on track toward getting it or not. And then for support, what do I have? What do I need? What do I want for support in this? I know I do not have all the skills and abilities to set this up and do this by myself. This is a huge undertaking and a huge project. So I need support. I need help, right? So what do I have for support and help? What do I need? And then what do I want for support and help? What do I want is a uh, multicultural team of people that are blind or have experience working with blind people to help me. And I'll probably create a board that helps me in terms of support, I don't have one for this particular project, but I think I want one, so that's something I would write down. So today our action item is to think about our ARS, our accountability, our resources, and support. What do we have? What do we need? What do we want? And jot down some notes about that. I like to make a little grid, a little chart, and just a couple of words is enough to trigger my memory for what it is that I have, need, and want. Things I have, great. I want to take those into account and appreciate that I already have them. The things that I need are slightly different than the things that I want. There are things that I'm going to absolutely positively need to have in place in these three areas that I don't have yet. And then there's other things that I just want because I think they'll make it a much more fun, awesome project and nonprofit organization. So, and then I need to touch base with the people that I'm here to serve and find out what are they really need and what do they really want. 
All right, that's it for today. If I can help you in any way, ask. Of course, there'll be a write-up, a guide 17 of the Get Up and Go Challenge private Facebook group. Uh, if you haven't joined that yet, there's tons of resources there. There's the last last year's whole annual challenge, this year's whole annual challenge videos, and starting February 1st, a chat GPT write-up. Uh, not edited. I will preface this uh, with that. Have not edited those. Probably never will because it's, you know, 303 days of content already. Uh, but it's just supplemental information on the topic that we're talking about that can help. In this instance, I'm going through my example of setting up my nonprofit. And so what resources do I have, need, and want are discussed there specifically for this goal. If you want to look in other areas or other aspects of goals, just search it in the sidebar and you'll get more information than you probably ever need or want. All right. Have an awesome day. I will, of course, be with you tomorrow. Have fun with this. Bye.